I'm a firm believer in education. And for the past 15 years, I've been professor of film at New York University, the Graduate Film School. I teach. Yeah. I think that if you have knowledge, you should teach, spread the knowledge. The first day of class, every year, I tell my students that hopefully you are here in this class, in my class, because you love film. Yeah. I always try to tell people, find something that you love. Not necessarily I'm going to choose a major because I think I can make the most money from that major. Find out what it is that you love. So when you can make a living doing what you love, you're blessed. Yeah. When you find out, if you're doing something that you love, it's not a job anymore. When I, when I, when I'm, when I have to wake up, when I'm doing my movies, commercial documentaries, and people like a 6 a.m. call in the morning, I don't even need an alarm clock to wake up because I'm excited I'm about to do something I love. So my mother would take me to the films. And I never wanted to go. And your parents, they have an ideal. So my mother was very smart. She wanted not just me, but she wanted to expose all her children to the arts. So even though I didn't want to be a filmmaker, all those seeds were planted when I was young. This is such a wonderful time if you're an artist to interpret, I mean, you are the future. I know it sounds cliche that you are the future, but sometimes cliches are true. And it's gonna be, the way you look at the world is gonna shape stuff. Whether you're a journalist, a painter, a sculptor, a screenwriter, a filmmaker, a documentary filmmaker, because this is, this is, this is how we do as human beings. No one lives forever. So it's a cycle, so we always need the infusion of the next generation to tell their story. So that's on you. So it is an imperative that you learn your craft. One of the biggest lies that is told to young people is that this whole magic of overnight success there is no such thing. Anybody who's done anything and has been successful, they busted their ass.